So yes, I'm very excited. We're going to a place that I've never been before in my whole life. Me neither. Really? First time. Singapore and Indonesia. It's gonna be crazy. First thing we see is a freaking butterfly garden. Leah's like so excited about the butterfly garden. Look at this. Okay, we have to go in here. She's getting ready right now, freshening up. Should I bring you guys in here? First impressions of Singapore? Pretty crazy place. We have a layover here for like three hours. This is crazy. Check this out though. No way. I guess these guys just hatch every day. This is their big terrarium. <laughs> I'm kind of mind blown right now. We got fresh pineapple for these guys. What? I would live here if I was a butterfly. They got waterfalls, fresh pineapples. Aliyah's gonna trip when she sees this. <laughs> I've never been to Singapore, but they've got koi fish in here. Apparently you can spend a full day in this airport. There's so much to do. But our flight's in two hours or three hours, and then we're going to Indonesia. We're gonna land in Jakarta and spend the next four days out there. I'm not gonna tell you what we're gonna do. It's gonna be a surprise. All right, you ready? It's so magical. I had to read you. I already took a bunch of B roll. I'll watch the bags, you can check it out. Oh my god. It's just butterflies. Who would have thought butterflies could make you this happy? It's a pretty cool place, right? I was explaining to them that you can spend the entire day at Singapore's airport, airport right? There's yeah. so much There's to do. There's so much activities like this yeah. inside like all three terminals. Yeah. Yeah, but. So we're gonna go. We're gonna try and do everything we can. Our last day, we have 23 hour layover at the airport. So it's gonna, we're be, not gonna a, be at the airport. It's we're gonna be outside. First meal in Singapore. <laughs> what is this? This is supposed to be like a famous Singaporean dish. It's like chicken rice. What do they call it? Hainanese? Hainanese? I don't know. Hainanese? Hainanese? Okay, so I will say the presentation is not there. Presentation is there. It looks really, really good. It smells good. It looks good. This and is that good. Looks, that kind of worries me. Why? But this, the What's three good? layer, what is this? Milk three tea? Layer coffee? Milk coffee. Soul. Yeah, this looks good. Mm -hmm. But yeah, we're just uh, waiting. Flight takes off in a couple hours, so yeah. I'm gonna enjoy this meal. And then we're gonna get on the slide. The slide. <laughs> they have a huge slide here. <laughs> if we have time, I'm doing it. <laughs> All right, we smash this. I had to record this because Leah's reaction is insane. It's so good. It's really good. The chicken is so good, and the rice is so good. It's like ginger with chicken or something. Probably a lot of butter. <laughs> this was so-so. The noodles are kind of weird. You want to try mine? Mm -hmm. I want to try yours. Let's see if Leah's telling the truth. I'll give you guys an honest reaction. Mm. Mm -hmm. I told you this. You always get what they specialize in. Wow. Oishi <laughs> desho. Now we need to make this. It definitely tastes better than what it looks like. How's the side dishes? Mmm. Mm. Spicy. Yeah, you put this sauce on. And then the cinnamon toast. 
Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Where's the milk? That's more I was like... not expecting that. Nah. That's not sweet. It's like, it's like a, a cracker. It's like a rice cracker. You can eat that. I'm sure that's more your style. 10 out of 10. No, we see on that. That is like a four, unfortunately. Okay. But, I don't know. Try it. Honest reaction. We see you. It's good? Yeah, I get why you said it tastes bland though. Yeah, it's really Definitely bland. Definitely not like miso or shoyu or shio. Yeah, like, I think that's what I was looking for, but it's really just like, oh, whatever. This is their style though. But the noodles are kind of weird, no? Simon? No, they just like noodle. fall apart in your mouth. It's not really a noodle. Anyways, there's your food critics of the day. <laughs> I did want to try this place that we're sitting next to because their ramen looks fire. But $21 for a bowl of ramen. This was only like 12 bucks. $21 for a bowl of ramen? That's pretty insane. But it's Singapore dollars, so it's still like $17 though. Oh, the food was pretty fire, but we need to take a shuttle or a train or something to the other side of the airport. Airport is huge, and we gotta get to the very other side to catch our flight. It's kind of like Japan vibes in here. I think it's way bigger though. But like, this is kind of Japan style though. Kind of mall looking area. Anyways, we'll be there soon. to get to our gate, but look what I found. This is the ultimate aquascapes. <laughs> Nerding out. Look at this, they got clown loaches, babe. Parrot fish, upside down catfish. Look at this tank. Yep, yep, they got little algae. Look at the clown loaches. Yeah, they have clown loaches. This is way too cool, guys. What the? Look, they have like Dior, Louis, Tiffany. This is so cool. Yep, definitely gotta spend a day here on our way back home. This is cool. All right, we're about to be late. We gotta go. Oh, there's more. They have cichlids. Oh, look. They got tiger barbs. We used to have a lot of these fish, though. Yeah. So cool. And that's that fish is dead. That fish is dead. All right, we gotta go. That is sick. I know. That is so cool. That's what you Dope. We arrived. Safe and sound. This is Jakarta. It's actually, I didn't know what to expect. It's like Hawaii. It's like Hawaii vibes for sure. The weather too, but I'm excited. We got KFC here. I don't know what I was expecting, but I wasn't expecting it to look like this. This is gonna be a pretty fun adventure. I'll share more later with you guys why we are here, but right now we gotta get to our hotel. So we're gonna hop in one of these taxis. We made reservations, now we're just following to the car. There's like Alfords here too. Same as your pants. Here's the whip. Right. Toyota Avanza. So far, so good. Bunch of bikers everywhere. It's pretty cool, all the bikes and stuff. Yeah. Old ramen. <laughs> this is cool. Dang, this hotel's actually really nice. Let me check out the room now. <laughs> this food looks nice. Oh my gosh. I'm so hungry. They just put this right in front of you. And they got a pool here too. A lot of key cards. They're like wooden keys. Dope. Nice, babe. Always with the good hotels. When we want a good hotel. <laughs> Actually, this is the hotel that um, our friend that we're going to meet tomorrow that's staying at oh, okay. this hotel. 90 bucks a night. $90 a night for two people. And it's like safe. And it's really and fancy. It's really clean and fancy. All right, let's check out the room. 
Okay, I like it. It's nice. We're on the 23rd floor, so nice view. Yeah, this is cool, babe. Oh my gosh. What? Sorry, I'm sorry. I know what? you're filming. I just freaked myself out. This is what? like my worst nightmare ever. Why? <laughs> what? You just. Okay, open it. Open it. What? It's just another door. <laughs> what was I seeing? What were you seeing? Quad. What is wrong with you? It was a hole. Josh, look. If you look like this, it you, looks like a hole. You're tripping. Josh, if you go like this, it looks like it's a hole that goes down. Oh, I guess so, it's yeah. So it's kind of scary. <laughs> you freaked so out. <laughs> this bathroom is pretty dope, though. I like how they did this. I love it. Nice shower. It's like cement floors. Like a jail cell vibe, you know? No, it's nice. <laughs> it is nice. I like it. It's nice and modern. Stoked. Yeah, the view's freaking amazing. Good job. See the highway? Yeah, look down there. It's a lot. There's Super so sick. Restaurants on this street, too. Yeah, Jakarta? Pretty sick. Pretty, yeah. Pretty, pretty epic. Sick. Let's go eat food time. Hold up. Check these out. Leah found these in Singapore. Spicy salted egg fish skin. What's wrong with you? <laughs> so good. I'm gonna try it. It was about to freeze in here. It was set on six degrees Celsius. Celsius. <laughs> it was about to start snowing through the vents. <laughs> Anyways, check this out. Fish skin. You know what? You try it. Yeah, I love this. Yummy? Mm -hmm. mm. So good. It's kind of addicting. That's really good. Oh my gosh. All right, let's go get real food. Wow, this is beautiful. Came to the restaurant inside the hotel. It's pretty cheap. It's like 16 bucks for a walkie burger. <laughs> and they have this awesome view. It's amazing. It's better when you have no clue what to expect, yeah, right? It's a, it's a way better surprise. Australian walkie burger, 258,000, which is like 16 US dollars. Yeah, that's kind of a vibe. Yeah, that's, that's <laughs> I'm pretty mind blown right now. I didn't look up online of what to expect in Jakarta. I thought it'd be better just to like make it a surprise. And I'm actually blown away. This is like really nice. <laughs> so the hotel for three nights was like less than 300 bucks. And it's like this nice. This is crazy. We'll explore tomorrow, but why we're here, that's gonna be a surprise for you guys tomorrow and a surprise for me because I don't even know why I'm here. I was invited <laughs> by Aisa and she's out here doing some drift stuff. Let's just say that. I don't know much about it, but she's like, hey, do you guys wanna come? And I was like, say no more. So <laughs> that's why we ended up in Indonesia. But anyways, back to the food. It is ridiculously cheap. It is? For what it is. Oh, I really? mean, we're in a hotel, right. you know? So hotel prices usually are crazy. Like you can expect a Wagyu burger back home mm. to be like 40 bucks, mm. you know? 16 bucks for a Wagyu burger is pretty Maybe insane. Australian Wagyu. Yeah. And they're really close to Australia. Yeah, but still though, like even all these dishes are about $11. That's cheap. I'm interested in this fried crispy calamari pd pd seasoning yeah that's like six dollars yes okay what if it's like this small it, it probably is <laughs> and the plate you... is this big <laughs> it's okay we're gonna try it oh this is cool all right let's go up there all right we got a stark ipa made in bali with the bean tang bean tang bean tang <laughs> I don't know, I'm probably gonna say a lot of stuff wrong here. <laughs> All day we've been like, how do you say that? So I asked the waiter, like, surprise me, what's the most local beer they have? And he pulled up with this. This looks fire though, I'm gonna try it. You got, you don't even is know what that is, huh? Rose made in Bali. Made in Bali? Yeah, Rose made in Bali. Sparkling one. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's cool. And if you're wondering about pricing, a beer is like five bucks. Cocktails like seven bucks. Not bad. Yeah. Oh my gosh! It's been a while since I had a burger. This looks pretty insane. Oh, a little bit of okay, okay, okay. I don't think I can eat all this, bitch. Are we just 
food critics now. <laughs> Anyways, we're gonna give it a shot. Australian Wagyu beef burger. Mm -hmm. All right, with the egg inside. Oh. An egg inside. Do this guy. It's pretty good. First of all, I haven't had a burger in a really long time. This is amazing. Really? That's so good. Uh, it's perfect. Look at that. You earned it, babe. Mm. You you earned this Did burger. I? I didn't really do anything. Yeah. <laughs> You've been working hard all year, so you earned this vacation slash business trip. I'm happy. Mm. <laughs> oh, I thought you were gonna start crying. <laughs> <laughs> this is the calamari. Yeah, it looks good. Going for it, babe. How's that? Good? Perfect. I didn't even dip it in the sauce. I'm not used to these long thick. living life right now. That looks like you're... Is that butterfish? Ginda. Ginda da. Which is butterfish. I think it's butterfish. Mm. This is so good. Yeah, it's like a famous Japanese dish. Just gotta order Japanese food order, when you're yeah. in uh, Indonesia. Yeah, well, because it's really expensive in Japan. Yeah, it's this like, is uh, like... Everything's like, pretty cheap. Yeah. That looks good. Oh, this is good. This is my favorite yeah. fish. Yeah. Fire! Come on, see it. It's yummy? Mm -hmm. Really? Mm -hmm. Love it? <laughs> I did the best I could with that burger, but I am so full. I couldn't eat all the calamari. But I do need to try this. Yeah, you have to try this. Amazing. That's so good. Wow. All right, enough food critiquing. Critiquing? Is that even a word? All right, we're going to end it here. We'll see you guys in the morning. Why are they walking so slow? Good morning from Jakarta. Look at this. This is insane. Look at this person crossing the street. Oh my gosh, that's so sketchy. You see how there's no lanes, guys? It's like a video game. Look at all the scooters. And they look like they're pretty dialed, too. Like, I don't think there's too many crashes often. Yeah, this is pretty cool. Check it out. Jakarta in the daytime. Oh, they've got like a main freeway over here. Looks like they're building new buildings over there. But we're gonna go down here for breakfast. Let's go. They have a river going all the way around this whole neighborhood. It's so cool. And the houses look super baller. Like, look at this. Look at this house right here. Dang, look at that house right there. So baller. This guy has a crazy... Babe, come look at this guy's house. Pool, turf on the roof. Mm -hmm. So nice. Look at this guy. This guy has like a basketball court on the roof. Mm. Just walked out of the hotel and it turns into an entire mall. This is crazy. They get H&M. I don't even think the mall is open yet, but we're trying to find breakfast. We're here with Arisa. She finally arrived. India. Are you gonna film today? No yeah, This place is crazy though. So we're here because we're gonna check out Indonesia's drift flight with Arisa. I'm gonna bring you guys with me. We'll get more to the after, but right now, we gotta go get breakfast. We ended up at a rooftop buffet. This place is wild. And it's like buffet all the way down. This restaurant is huge. I don't know where to start. And then the views. This is wild. Pretty mind blown. Loving it, loving it. Let's go eat. Is this turning into just a food channel? <laughs> I'm having a time on my life. Right? This is amazing. It's so fancy. I don't even know what I got. But she's making us omelets over there. Oh yeah. Lychee drink. Check this out. Fresh omelets. It just keeps going on and on. Look at this, it's a dumpling station. Look at this. I went to a good friend of mine. Well, we pulled up at a mall on the side of the street, it seems like. And the mall has the drift course. Literally right next to the mall. There's like no zoning out here. Just make as much noise as you want. <laughs> This is crazy. The city circuit. The city circuit. J99 Max. Oh, they I got Sylvia's the 180s. <laughs> I like it already. <laughs> All right, it's really windy right now. I think we're gonna be able to sample some of the drift cars here. This is insane. You got a 180 S15 front. He just built this. He said he built it in 
three weeks. TJ Swap S14, and we're in Indonesia. This is so cool. That's wild, no? TJ S14. Hey, the 180 with the S15 front. This is cool. Yeah, look at this. This is crazy, guys. The opportunities that Arisa gives us are amazing. Thanks for inviting us, really. Oh, thank you. <laughs> this wouldn't have happened if we didn't meet with Arisa. Right. Because all thanks to Arisa. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Of course. How could I say no? This is amazing. <laughs> so cool. Last minute, so last minute. Here. She's like, you guys want to go to Indonesia like yesterday? I didn't even think about no, it. No, we just said yes. She said she was surprised that we said like, yeah, we'll go. We've <laughs> <laughs> only known you for like 30 days. <laughs> <laughs> let's go on a, you know, let's go out of the country together. <laughs> We're still drifting. Everywhere we go, we just got to go drifting. We actually have another girl drifter here. This is Rachel, she drifts this. She's a drifter here in Indonesia. We're ready, boys. Hopefully I can shred a car here. They're gonna go out real quick. Show Arisa the line. I think she's gonna hop in this and go drift. This is cool. Get it, Arisa. <laughs> checking out the drift scene. So apparently this is a drifting academy. So they rent out drift cars and you can rent the car and the track for the day. It's like 700 bucks, but oh, we're gonna take a picture. <laughs> Ended up in the real part of Jakarta. It's a lot different than where we are. on the side of the street. I like it. Getting the full experience right now. <laughs> Just pulling up. Whoa. It's so random. What's going on? <laughs> Guys, where do we end up? This is crazy. Can I see that? <laughs> What? It's full Tomei? Tomei OS88 gearbox. Wow. OS clutch also? 
four quad play boys club. <laughs> so look at that turbo, it's huge. Ferrari. Everything is so clean. The shop is so clean. This 2K up here. Wow, everything is so clean. <laughs> Just keep all your cars so clean. Another. This is a Tomei special engine. This is 3.2. 2.2? Like 1,000 horsepower plus? 1.4 it was, I think, 600 wheel on 98, pump 98. And turbo is yes. massive. Really clean. <clears throat> FD. Just cars after cars. Baby, you notice how clean everything is? It's such a big shop. we got like the little storefront right here too. Jeez. Type R boys. On the boys. This is crazy. That's all I can say is this is crazy. Wow. Wow. Look, someone signed this. Enjoy and be safe. This is a K26. <laughs> I've never heard of such thing. K26 dry sub. CNC ported head, sequential gearbox. <laughs> street car. The street car. Every sequential. Every 55 set up and uh, Nitrox. NOS, WMI, ethanol. Love it. <laughs> you guys built some wild stuff. And the Honda Fit, he said, has sequential in it. Billet bell housing, Beckert, sequential. Oh my gosh. 300 wheel. In this thing, 300. What? 300. <laughs> sequential. This is a 12 year old strip car. This is an amazing gift for a 12 year old. Everything they do in house here. They've got an engine room. Hello. Hello. Wow. This is Mr. Tanaka. How are you? I'm fine. Just building engines back here. <laughs> Transmissions. What? Oh, this is nice, man. 964 Turbo, 3.3 Turbo, GTR R35 T1 Stroker kit engine. What? Uh, K24, uh, this is our crate engine. Okay. Uh, this is the Highcom spec NA crate engine we sell. Shh. Everything's brand new. Yeah. This, this is, all brand is new. our race engine for our race circuit. So cool. He built engine. He's a part of our racing support team. Okay. They are the people who make it work. <laughs> <laughs> Good job, guys. <laughs> Thank you. Drag cartel. Drag cartel crate engine. You guys, are, you guys are doing it. Full race manifold. Mm. It's K27 stroker. I call him K27. Oh my gosh. I think he's gonna make some good power. <laughs> These guys build probably three or four of the fastest Evos in Indonesia right now. Really? Built by them? Built by them, supported by them. You guys are geniuses, man. Oh my gosh. Just endless. Wow, that's it. So everything which is hand ported before we install it, normally we fill the heads. Oh, okay. Ooh, what is this little guy right here? Oh, uh, that's the Jimny. Jimny? Yeah, the turbo kit is made by us, so we have a turbo kit called Craftman Turbo. Okay. Which is all fabbed in house, fabricated in house, okay. installed in house, and this is a kit we sell. What? You guys have so much stuff, man. It's endless. Pretty mind blown right now, we're in Indonesia. And you guys saw where we were. Just checking out all the cars. City's gonna start it up for us. I never think that this car has gnarly Tomei engine.
also a chef. I wasn't expecting steak right now. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Park shop. This is cool. Oh, this is the dream. Lawrence. Thank you, Lawrence. <laughs> no worries. <laughs> Thank you. That's our driver right here. Okay, all day driving. Thank you so much. And burgers. They brought us burgers. Steak and burgers. <laughs> Look at that burger. Fries. Bye. Thank you. Thanks for coming. <laughs> that was epic. I forgot we were here. I like being in that shop and it's all nice coming out here. Like, oh yeah, we are here. Imagine picking an Airbnb on this room. Alright, we're back in the hotel. That whole experience was insane. I don't even know what to say about it, but we're gonna go explore. I don't know if it's that safe. We're gonna try and find a place. We're gonna get like waters and stuff for the night. First time walking out in Indonesia. No one really walks out around here, so we might see something crazy. There's no sidewalk. No idea where we're going. I'm pretty sure this is not a sidewalk. What is that? Rear suspension? Just rear. Whoa. That's a taxi. I guess we're just gonna walk. I'm so confused at how this works. I mean, it's nice though, you know? What if this is totally what we're not supposed to do? I'm pretty sure this is not what we're supposed to do. We're the only people doing this. Yes, we are. This is very scary. But the worker said it's okay, so. This is Indonesia's kombini. Look at all the different chips. Ah, oh, it's too much. I want to try everything. This is the noodle section. It's like Pansik Kanton. But look at this, it says Rasa. Rasa sauce Japan. Japan. I think that's how they say Japan. <laughs> I'm guessing this is oil? Dude, this is crazy. Oh, you need that, babe. So I don't know what anything is, so I don't know what's the best thing to try. <laughs> so I'm probably not gonna get anything, but it is cool seeing their kombinis. Everything is really cheap. Like a bag of chips here is like 65 cents US. And they're like pretty big chips. And I did find my vitamin drink, but they make it in mango. So good, we don't even have this in Japan. Seaweed flavor, I don't even know. It's got crazy flavors. Like what is that? That looks fire. Everything looks fire. Gotta get the ghost pepper though. <laughs> oh yeah. Look at the Hot Wheels section. Get the little bosuzoku. <laughs> kisha. Is it kisha? Mm. I gotta get it. I want this too. Yeah, they have like little food vendors on the side. This is the kick it spot. Back at the hotel. It's a complete different vibe up here, right? Just literally down the street. I feel safe. <laughs> <laughs> it is a bit grimy, but I kind of like it. It's kind of, it's so different. Now we're just like in this luxury, oh, back in Japan. <laughs> right, we got some stuff. 